The Telenco Universal Pole Bracket, or UPB, is manufactured from high-strength aluminium alloy and is designed to secure all the Telenco terminating clamps. It can secure drop wire clamps, aerial cable, and stay wire. It is secured to the pole either by using a 16mm bolt or by 20mm stainless steel banding. The UPB can be fitted in the existing hole on the pole. However, if the existing hole is in the incorrect plane or is already in use, then drill a hole 300 millimeters down from the present hole using an 18 millimeter auger and attach the UPB by means of a 16 millimeter bolt of suitable length. The 16 millimeter bolts have a hexagonal head and nut and are supplied with two washers, one square and the other rectangular. One of these washers is required at the rear of the pole if there is no other device installed. Either or, or both of the washers can be used. Insert the bolt through the hole in the center of the UPB and secure at the rear using the washer and nut supplied, tightened by means of a 24 mm spanner. Alternatively, the universal pole bracket can be attached to the pole by means of the 20 by 0.7 mm stainless steel banding system. Cut two lengths of banding to the required length. Take a 20 mm stainless steel buckle and slide the banding through the buckle. Bend the banding as shown, ensuring that a minimum of 25 mm has been bent back. Pass the banding through the top apertures of the universal pole bracket and around the pole. Pass the free end through the buckle as shown. Pull the steel band tight and position the bracket in the required position on the pole. The tensioning tool is threaded for ease of tensioning. It has a cutting lever and a banding holding mechanism which grips the stainless steel banding. Tension is achieved by turning the handle. Place the banding in the tool as shown. Turn the handle, tensioning the band. Keep turning until the desired tension is achieved. When the required tension has been achieved, move the banding through 90 degrees towards the buckle. This action locks the banding. Release the tension and reverse the handle, allowing the banding tool to slide back approximately 20 millimeters, then operate the cutting handle as demonstrated. Lock off the banding as demonstrated. Place the second the band should in be the position as indicated in the demonstration. The using Place the, the same second band in the position before. indicated in the demonstration using the same method as before. The universal pole bracket can also be used on concrete and metal poles. Two brackets may be fitted utilizing one bolt in a back-to-back -back position as shown. Installation of the universal pole bracket in this manner requires no flat washer. It is also possible to place the brackets back to back using the stainless steel banding method. Either one or both apertures in the center either side of the bolt can be used for terminating aerial cable. This aperture can be used for aerial cable and is the only aperture that can be used for staying. Up to three drop wires can be attached to any one of the apertures providing it is not already in use by an aerial cable or a stay.